Tonight at 6, a woman rushed to the hospital after police say she got illegal at-home liposuction, the concerning evidence detectives found in the trash. Plus, after a devastating Game 2 loss to the Cavaliers, Celtics are looking to turn things around for Game 3. And moments were live in Cleveland where fans are gearing up for the big game and a real feast for the eyes as the Northern Lights grace the skies above New England. Details on your next chance to see them. News at 6 starts now. Now we start with developing news on the war in the Middle East. Israel issuing an urgent warning to Palestinians to evacuate parts of Rafah in southern Gaza. Good evening, I'm Matt Pritchard, in for Darren Botello. Now, Palestinians are being told to seek shelter in a designated humanitarian zone. Video shows Israeli troops on the border of Rafah with black smoke rising over the city. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu calls the assault necessary to destroy Hamas following the group's deadly attack back on October 7. Now, back here at home, a rally protesting Israel's electricity threw a power outlet on the roof. We're told the woman had been living there for about a year and had Whoa. space for a printer, computer, even a coffee machine. Whoa. Police say she was cooperative. She did agree to leave, but uh, of all the places to wind up. <laughs> I would never expect that. It's the extension cord yeah. that gave up her spot. And a coffee maker, too. A coffee Man, maker. <laughs> yeah, talk about human ingenuity. <laughs> okay. Let's talk about weather. What, what are we looking at? Yeah, as yeah. we go through the evening, clouds are going to be building. So the Aurora forecast, if you're going to try to get out there and view it, you're going to want to try to go between sunset and midnight. If you can get outside and even look up, it's harder to see with the naked eye, but when those clouds build, it will be even more difficult to see. If you pull out your camera, keep it on night mode and go to take a photo, that's when you get to see those beautiful colors. A good night for me to be on the 11 o'clock oh, show. Oh, yes. Yeah, we'll see it. <laughs> that's all the time that we have for the 6 o'clock show. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Matt Pritchard, meteorologist Sydney Welch here as well. We'll see you back here at 11 o'clock. NBC Nightly News starts right now.